Okay, so we just got back from a trip with the rescue wagon, and one of the things, we have a generator for it, but this generator um, typically doesn't ride in it. it if, we, if we want to stop in a Walmart parking lot, it's hard to kind of get it all set up and everything. So I talked to my guy at work who does welding for me, and this is about 100 pounds. And he was saying he could put it on here, but it would be about another 40 pounds of, of stuff to hold it in. It might be a little too heavy on the tongue weight. So, went to Sam's Club and I picked up this. Now, I'm not sure if this is going to run our air conditioner or not. We don't have a battery system that's charging while we use it. So we're going to try and run this and see if it will run the air conditioner without any hiccups. If it does, then mounting this one up on the front will be a lot easier. It's only, it's less than 50 pounds. Okay, so with this power source, we've got to uh, line this up, lock it in. Uh, it's a 60 amp um, service that's inside there. It doesn't use anywhere near that much. Mainly, we're just running the air conditioner and the fridge inside. All right, I'm going to put that on start, which has the choke on it. We've been running this generator for about 30 minutes. Um, it is running the air conditioner on high cool inside. I've got the LED lights on the inside turned on. The microwave light is on and the fridge is running. So far we have not overloaded it all. You can tell occasionally when the compressor comes on, you can hear it start to work a little harder. So now I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to brew some coffee at the same time. I'm just going to run the hot water through, not going to actually brew coffee, but we're going to see if we can get it to overload, if that does it, kind of where, where our limits are on this. So that definitely overloaded it. So I'm going to shut this off. And then I'm going to reset. All right, we ran the generator last night for probably four hours. It ran the air conditioning on high. It ran the refrigerator, the lighting inside. Uh, the lights were on on the microwave. I didn't try the microwave, but then I thought, oh, I'm gonna get cocky and try to brew some coffee. Uh, it would not uh, do the coffee. However, for everything that we need, it really is probably gonna do it. We can shut the air conditioning off to do the coffee, that type of thing. So uh, for next week, I've got scheduled with my guy at work. He's gonna weld up a unit up here so that we can place that there and have it when we travel. So super pumped and uh, looking forward to it. All right, we got the rescue wagon back and uh, my guy, he did a fabulous job welding up this box to hold the generator. Uh, this is so strong, it'll hold a couple of grown men standing on it. I added this little cable here to keep it, uh, keep it locked up. We're going to um, take the electrical cable and I bought another one of these. We're going to get another piece, have a short piece that comes around so that it is not too long. We can leave it plugged in while we're traveling. And then when we stop, pull the cord, fire it up, we're good to go. This little rig right here. This rescue wagon allows me to be free.